Okay, talk is cheap, right? So I'm gonna do a little bit of it myself, and then we'll really get down to business. Look who's back, right? This is probably my most faithful viewer of the channel. Not to, you know, say anything about the rest of you guys, but when you talk about commitment, the first thing I think of is BNR Racing, right? Committed to this channel. But he made a comment, right, mentioning me, I, th I think. It's kind of hard to... Well, there it is. I'll you know, just let you read that while I, you know, talk, ramble. I think it's about me. I don't... Not 100% sure because of reasons I'll say in a minute, but if it is, you know... I, you know, okay, I started reading it, right, as you probably are, and, well, one thing got to be kind of clear, um, well, I, you know, it, it's kind of, it's kind of sad to say, but the, really what just pops out when I read this is, this guy needs to work on his grammar. I can barely understand a single sentence of this man's comment, right? I, I don't know what he's trying to tell me. I, I, I really do, like, look, you need a spell check, and you know what? I'll help you out. Let, let's try to read this together first. Then I will, you know, do a little editing and try to make it understandable, and then we'll reread it to really get what he's trying to say across. A bit of a long story, Brian. I called that race throne setup for Stanford to win. That's not proper sentence grammar. Uh, so easy to arrange, period, just through dollar signs to people, period. I am in NNN registered again. Took abuse 2022, couldn't make it like Nolan. I don't know who Nolan is. Got called out by a fat fight, fike, fike? Fike? I, I don't know what that means either. In Minnesota, I called him Jabba the Hutt from Star Wars. Okay. After he tr threatened me with his cold 45 8 inch barrel. What the hell's a cold 45? Uh, maybe. Uh, okay. Shot a watermelon at 6 inches away. Wait, is he talking about my Colt 45? Well, for one thing, it's a seven and a half inch barrel, so you're approximate six inches away. I'm not quite sure about either if you didn't get the barrel length right. Uh, that's not how you spell Colt either. But anyways, anyways. Uh, shot the watermelon six inches away on his channel, Scare Tactics. Who am I trying to scare? The watermelon? I mean, the watermelon's not scared, but it's gone. I don't know what to tell you there. Uh, told me to come to Minnesota to race him. Yeah, I did. I offered him to come up race the Mustang in Minnesota, but he he didn't take. Uh, with my 1970 and a half. Okay, Trans M R A I V four speed. It's down yet. Oh, it doesn't work. Okay, I see. It's down yet. Custom diamond pistons. Uh, bot paid for in full. I mean, yeah, that's normally you have to buy and pay for them in full before they send them to you. They don't usually just send you stuff if you don't fully pay for it. Should be done soon. Oh, God, I hope so. Uh, I took more, uh, you know, abuse than you can imagine. I can imagine. I can imagine. Don't you worry. I fight my own battles, I die, I die. What what battles are, what kind of keyboard comments are you getting into where the death is penalty? I, I don't see how typing on a keyboard is going to get you there, bud. But all right. Not stupid enough to take my long time TA Trans Am, I guess. I have owned since 1994. I bought it 28, now 53. Okay, I don't need to know your whole life story. Just get to the point here. They come to me in Illinois to street race at night. So, 
okay, so it's perfectly okay for you to tell people to go to Illinois, but you're not going to come to Minnesota? That seems kind of hypocritical. Uh, all right. Um, oh, my 97 454 Gen 6 pickup. C2500 runs good. Not great, but good. 410 gears with a no slip. What's a no slip? Is that like a limited slip? I've never heard of a no slip. Okay. Power teaks. Tax. T. 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 Okay. Detroit locker. I installed recently. I'm sure you installed it yourself. Surprise them all. Who's all? Who witnessed this? How quick and 500 foot long twin strip rubber laid down just meshing the gas pedal. Well, is, was it 500 foot long? I mean, you, you overestimated the barrel length. And I'm not quite sure you got the actual distance between the melon and the gun. You know what? I, I, that, that, that's the comment. There, there's the comment. So needless to say, we got some work ahead of us, all right? Trying to make this literarily conceivable, all right? You know, but, but I spent the time for everybody. Here is the revised version. Let's read it together. That's a bit of a long story, Master. I had said that the race between Bottle Rocket and Casper was set up for so Stanford would win. I believe it was easy to arrange that race for Stanford to win by paying off the legendary mop guy. I am registered for the NNN again this year. Last year, in 2022, I had taken so much criticism and decided not to come out of fear of people saying mean words to me. I'd just recently been called out myself from a fat guy in Minnesota who I now call Jabba the Hutt. Jabba the Hutt is a character from my favorite franchise, Star Wars. He owns a Colt 45 revolver with a 7.5 inch long barrel that I felt threatened by personally when I first saw it in his video. He had shot a watermelon with it at very close range and it was scary. He said if I want to race him in my 1970 Trans Am, I can come to Minnesota any time and have a race with him. It was very polite of him, actually. But my Trans Am still doesn't run. But I just purchased new pistons for it with my own money, which I'm very proud of. I hope it will be done soon. Master. I have taken so much criticism from people not believing my mechanical advice that it just makes me want to cry to you about it. I fight my own battles and sometimes I die in GTA 5. It's a very hard game for me. I'm not brave enough to take my Trans M that I've owned since I was 28 to go race his Mustang in Minnesota. Mine doesn't even run yet. But I did a burnout in my pickup truck the other day, and I was really impressed with myself. Love, heart, B&R racing. Okay, see, now I can understand what he's trying to say. Look, B&R, it's okay that your Trans M doesn't run yet, okay? That, that's, that's perfectly fine. After all, you still got your truck, right? And it did do that really impressive burnout that amazed everybody. Now, I don't know who everybody is, but I'll tell you what, you come up here and race the Mustang in your truck, we got a place right there, Brainerd International Raceway, right? NHRA event area, right there, right? Big place, good track. Me and you, right there. May 16th, Tuesday, right? Seven o'clock p.m. We'll race, we'll live stream. That way everybody can be impressed with how good your truck is. As a matter of fact, the link to the live stream is already up. Okay? So go ahead, click on that link, click the notification button, right? Well, technically the link's in the description. That's just the thumbnail. But right there, link's already up. We're live streaming whether you decide to show up or not. So, you going to be a man and show up? Or are you going to let past histories repeat itself? Up to you.
I'll be waiting for you.